These two teams will never forget 2019, a title race that went down to the final day with Marinos made champions. This season, they've found their momentum yet again, with Dyson Maeda and co. unbeaten since opening day. On the other side, the Capital Club has found recent weeks difficult. Three straight losses in the league have Tokyo tumbling down the table. It's a side that can't stop winning against a side hoping to stop their slide. Don't count these teams out. They simply don't know when they're beat. Avispa shocks San Frecce with a second half winner, giving the newly promoted side another marquee win after coming back from a goal down. In Saitama, Urawa also came from behind, leaving it late before Makino and Tanaka collected all three points. It's two teams who never stop believing until the final whistle. All that matters now is survival. Oita are in the J1 basement, having lost their last seven in the league. It's a long way back to safety, and to do it, they'll need to take on a fellow relegation candidate. S-Pulse dropped a big three points in their last contest, conceding a late equalizer in painful fashion. In a league where every point matters, collecting all three in this one will be huge. These two teams don't mind leaving it late. Last week, a Belmade bullet header got them back a point. While Sapporo took all three, courtesy of an old face. Jay Bothroyd is back in the goals, taking the pressure off an attack focused around the brilliance of Anderson Lopez. It's two teams hoping they can start as fast as they finished last week. Shonan-sensei. 